What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Dante Williams, aka the Big Lick Trucker, holding it down for kids gotta eat trucking. You know, in the other videos, I was telling y'all that I purchased my own truck. Well, bam! This is my baby right here. It's an old school truck. I went with an old school truck because all of y'all know, started December 18th, uh, the United States DOT has uh, said that any truck 1999 or newer has to go to e logs. So I just didn't want to be on e logs, I'd rather be on uh, paper logs. So I decided to get an older truck. Plus, I love the cab over, you know. And when I was a little boy, these were the trucks that were on the road. So, you know, I'm all about the old school, so I had to kick it old school. All right, this is a 1989 International 9700 cab over. It has a Cummins, uh, what is it, 8, 853 motor in it. Uh, it's a nine speed, you know. I never driven a nine speed, all I've driven is 10 speeds, but it's no different once you get the hang of it. So come on inside and I'm gonna show you the inside of my, right, let, let's do a walk around actually. All right. Now these are your steps to get in it. As you can see, it sits a whole lot higher than your traditional uh, truck that you have now. The tires, most of everybody on the new trucks are running the 22.5 low profile, but these are the 24.5s tall tires. So it sits a lot higher, a lot more rubber on the road, and it gets the wind underneath the vehicle, so it keeps the engine a little cooler when, when you're rolling. I, I have dual tanks. These tanks are 122 gallons, so it, it can hold close to um, 275 gallons on both of them. Alrighty, this is my spare tire. Those are my four batteries. It takes four just like a standard one. You already know the, the hoses. It ain't a whole lot to that. Uh, my fifth wheel. The only difference, this is leaf spring suspension. So there's no airbags. Uh, I, I wanted to go with leaf spring because if I wanted to strengthen the toe, all I, I have to do is just add another leaf to it and it, it'll strengthen the suspension, I mean. Um, Standard fifth wheel operation, ain't a whole lot to that. Uh, you know, mud flat, same thing. You know, everything you do on your pre-trip, you do the same thing here. Only difference is a lot less parts, you know, which is good for me. That means a lot less things that could go wrong, you know. So this is it, you know. I want, I want to put the dual exhaust pipes on it. You know how you have it sticking up old school, you know. But uh, truck got to make money before I can do all of that. But uh, what I did do is all new batteries, all new alternator, all new starter, all new electrical lines. So I just redid all of that stuff. So when I do put it on the road, that, that's one less thing I have to worry about. Uh, we're gonna go inside. Like I said, it's hard to get into these. So I'm gonna pause it and I come right back to y'all. All right, we back. This is the inside of a cab. It ain't a whole lot like it is to a new truck because there's no storage like it is in a new truck. This is my gear shift right here. Like I said, it's a nine speed. This is my air brake, parking brake. This is my signal. This is my radio. I haven't put my CB in it yet. I do have a CB for it. I just didn't put it in yet because I haven't put it on the road yet. This is your trolley brake right here. Uh, your hazardous, you know, it's it's just cut and dry. This is your throttle, your idle throttle. If you you know, if you're parking, you're idling, it speeds it up, slows it down right here. I had to look at the owner's manual to figure out what the hell this was, you know. And this is my bed right here. And uh, right now I only have a twin, but I ordered a full size because you can see it has a whole lot more room so you could get a bigger bed on here. But I, I got it on order. And as you can see, y'all, these are the t-shirts that I have for sale. It's the Kids Gotta Eat Trucking t-shirts. We have them in black and we have them in white. We asked in a small donation of $15. And that money is going to help fund the business. So, you know, we got a couple of other fundraisers coming up. But right now, we focusing on selling these t-shirts. So, much love and respect to everybody. Please help us out. Um, go to the website, Kids Gotta Eat Trucking, 
and order a t-shirt we got direct paypal um you can order right off the site it'll be in your front door probably in a week or two uh, from the day that you purchase it um uh, we got a bus out and coming up. Oh, also we got these right here. Now these are a little bit more expensive because it's multicolored. So it's a little bit more expensive to make. But if you are interested in getting these, email me, Oshazi at kidsgottoeattrucking.com and I'll give you all the information on getting the color ones, all right? This is your boy, Big Lip Trucker, Dante Williams, AKA signing out and I'm out.